This is huge. What if you can infuse your own knowledge into ChatGPT using Assistance API? What if you can upload document file, text file, CSV file, HTML file, PDF file, and many more file into ChatGPT using Assistance API or ask it to analyze data? That's exactly what we're going to see today. Let's get started. Hi everyone, I'm really excited to show you about how to upload files to ChatGPT assistance via API. Before that, I regularly create videos about AI in my YouTube channel. So if you haven't subscribed, do subscribe and stay tuned. Coming to assistance API. We have already covered this before, but as a quick summary, first we are going to create assistant as a data analyst. Then we are creating a thread to initialize the chat. Then we are creating a message that is a question by the user Mervin Prazen asking the assistant and then we are running the code. I will link about this in the description below. To summarize, first we are initializing the client, then we are creating assistant, data analyst, then we are creating a thread, third we are adding a message asking a question, what are the most popular tracks and their artists? We are going to ask this question to the data analyst. Next we are running the assistant, finally we are checking the run status if the run status is completed, then you're printing the messages. Now we need to add files or infuse knowledge to this assistance. To do that, file equals create.files.create and then file open songs.csv then purpose equals assistance and then closing the bracket. I already have a file called songs.csv. It looks like this, track ID, track name, track artist, track popularity and much more. I got this data from Kaggle which contains 30,000 songs from Spotify. After setting up the file variable, we are passing that to the assistance create function. Now we are adding files by file IDs equals file.id. You can get the file.id from the previous file which we just mentioned. Next, we are going to add tools. I'm going to say type equals code interpreter. This is used for analyzing the uploaded data. That's it. So we just simply created a file using this function and then assigning that file ID in the file IDs list. Then we mentioned the tools type equals code interpreter. Now we are going to run this code. Python knowledge.py. That's where I've stored my code and click enter. Now we can see the status as is queued now and it's using code interpreter. We can see the file ID here, which we just uploaded. And again, it's checking for the status. It says in progress, the loop will run till the status says completed. Now you can see the status got completed and we got the answer here. Dance Monkey by Tunes and I with a popularity score of 100. Roxane by Arizona with a popularity score of 99. That's it, as simple as that. We can see the same data analyst assistant in the OpenAI playground. You can see the code interpreter here and the songs.csv here. You can even ask your question directly here. Today we have seen infusing knowledge and analyzing with code interpreter. We have already covered Assistance API with Python, Assistance API with Node.js, Assistance API with function calling. I will link those in the description below. In the upcoming videos, we'll be seeing reading images and files from code interpreter, file management, retrieving input and output logs, and finally knowledge retrieval. That's when you infuse knowledge or upload files and convert that to a vector database and querying that. That is more advanced level, which we will be seeing in the upcoming video. So stay tuned. I hope you like this video. Do like, share and subscribe and thanks for watching.